Eastings and Northings, Eastings are vertical red lines on topographical maps. They are called Eastings as their numbers increase to the east. Northings are horizontal red lines on topographical maps. These numbers increase to the north. So, they are called Northings. These Eastings and Northings, same like longitudes and latitudes, are used to locate features and to find features on topographical maps. One grid square is equal to one square kilometer on the ground and two centimeters on the map. Four figure grid reference. Four figure grid reference contains four numbers. The first two numbers are called the easting, which is the number you would look for at the bottom of the map. The second two numbers are called the northing and represent the numbers you would look for on the side of the map. Where these two sets of numbers intersect is the bottom, left corner of the square where you would find what you are looking for. Six-figure grid reference. If you want to pinpoint an exact place on a map, you will need to use a six-figure grid reference. In the six-figure grid reference, only six figures are used. Therefore, it is called a six-figure grid reference. Spot heights, triangulated heights, benchmarks, surveyed trees, lime kills, post offices, causeways, temples, police stations, wells, bridges etc. are located with the help of six-figure grid reference. Method 1. Divide the grid with nine horizontal and vertical lines i.e., divide to tenths. The grid square between two consecutive eastings and northings is divided into ten equal parts, divide a grid square into ten equal parts vertically then horizontally. Write the reference number of eastings first and next, leave a single digit space then, write the reference number of northings. I.e. first three figures are eastings and next three figures are northings. For example, if the feature is located between third horizontal line and fourth horizontal line write 3 as the sixth digit. If the fifth line is on the feature write 5 as the reference number. Method 2. First find the four figure grid reference for the square and write it down with a space after each set of numbers. Use these transparent sheets to divide one grid square into 100 tiny squares. These are available for ICSE students with few topographical map workbooks. Now this square is divided up into 100 tiny squares with 10 squares along each side. For example, if first vertical line from left is on the feature, write 1 as the third digit. If fourth horizontal line from the bottom is on the feature write 4 as the sixth digit of your answer. Method 3. Cut 1 2 cm grid square from these types of graph papers. Place it below the feature to count third digit of the easting and place it after the feature or before the feature horizontally for the sixth digit. Method 4. Measure the distance from the easting in millimeter then divide with 2. This digit can be written as the third digit. Then measure the distance from northing in millimeter then divide with 2. This number can be written as the sixth figure. Things to remember. If there is half after division, adjust the number. For example, when we divide 7 mm we get 3.5 but write either 3 or 4. When you measure, measure to the center of the symbol. If the feature is located on Eastings just write 0 as the third digit. If it is on the Northing just write 0 as the sixth digit. When it comes between the lines, follow the same method of four figure grid reference. For example, if feature come between second horizontal line and the third horizontal line, write 2 as the sixth digit.